Hey, it's Mike and John from PumaPlow.com playing some more Farming Simulator on the Xbox. Here in a map I'm not allowed to name. We're in Hagenstad, and John, things have changed. I almost said nap. Uh-oh, what changed? So. I see another Schluter. We were playing along, you know, in Hagenstad. Um. Doing the classic thing. And, what did you do? You know, whatever. Yeah. And I decided I didn't really like the way it was going. Because you were playing on normal, and it's hard. And well, it, here's the thing. It's too much grind. To show all the different equipment that I want to show? Yeah. It's a lot of money. Yes. And it was going to take me forever. And the next game's coming out sometime this fall, so... So, I decided to do things a little differently. Yeah. So, here's the changes I've made. Mid-season, you've... I've, I'm hiding in the trees, first off. Yeah, look out for so, Charlie. I completely started over. Yeah, you started right? a new a new map. A new map. I played to a certain point where I thought we were about the same. Yeah. I have my chickens, blah, 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 blah. Okay. So, as I was playing, I planted some canola in that field and planted some barley. You have the fog as well. I have a fog... In fact, let's stop by and pick up some eggs real quick. Oh boy! I know, right? I couldn't remember oh how many God chickens. Oh my God Almighty! I couldn't remember how many chickens I have, so I have 50 chickens now. Oh, I don't. remember. I think it was close. I just don't remember. You could have just spawned into that map. Yeah, it sounds like work. Or did you delete it? No, it's still there. I still have it. Okay. But anyway, we're playing on easy, and we're actually going to go more towards a focused approach on this map. Yes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to focus on a couple certain things. A couple certain. All right. A couple certain things. One, on this field I have up here now. Yes. I'm going to start planting, maybe not this week, maybe next week. We're going to start with sugar beets. Oh, snap. I've never done sugar beets before. I've done potatoes. Yeah, sugar beets are... I'm up there. It's, dude, it's magic. So, I'm going to start uh, sugar beeting the heck out of that field, let's yeah. say. Yeah. And then I'm also going to get into cows. All right. Because Hagenstadt is the place to do cows with the green grass. Yeah, definitely. So, um... And you've done cows before, so you know what you're doing. I've done cows before. I like doing cows. Yeah. I did them on America with that gray grass, and it's just hard. Or the brown grass, I should say. Yeah. So I think that's... Oh, maybe not. Almost all of them. This is the worst Easter egg hunt ever. Seriously, you need to come in here with a little cultivator uh -huh. and get rid of all the grass. Can I get rid of the trees, too? No. Yeah. Cultivator doesn't cultivate Okay, trees. anyway. Whoop, there's another egg. So, as I was planting everything, a... And, I, you know, I've got a little bit of money, obviously. I've maxed out on my loan again, obviously. Yeah. But as I was playing... A great demand for barley hit. Awesome. Just so happens I have two rounds of barley that I've combined. Oh, wow. That How many harvest is harvest harvest I have, have you have done? Have done? Probably six or seven. Oh, wow. Yeah. You played it quite a bit then. So I wanted to be able to, well, like, that's about right. you know, go. So I'm still going to go through the same steps with the equipment, you know, using the oldest first, all that good yeah, stuff. Yeah, from here From, from here, here on. on. I mean, obviously I have two schluters. So I had one last time. Yeah. But I needed this, I needed them both to do what I had to do. I don't remember this great, where this great demand is though. At the, the mill. mill. Which one's the mill? Hang around. That's right. up north or south, right? South, yeah. Okay. So we won't quite get all the barley I have, but what I'll have left is minimal. Yeah, I you don't just really care. Leave those frankly. six thousand liters. Yeah, you see, I have a hundred thousand liters of canola. That's awesome. I've done, like I say, six or seven harvests, and there's canola in the field right now too. Planted. Planted. It's almost done. What we're going to have to do is actually, because I have to get this to the mill before the great demand runs out. Yeah. So we're going to sell this, and then we're going to fast time for a little bit. Awesome. Because the canola is like probably five hours from being ready. Yeah. Hopefully some of this fog burns off. That'd be it's, nice. It's another lovely uh, German day today, I guess. Here in Hagenstadt. Here in Hagenstadt, right? No. No. I had somebody tell me that they were disappointed that they don't no longer hear Hagenstaura during these videos. To that person, I say, too bad. Shout out to Brady. Wow. <laughs> anyway. He did. He literally um, said that. Wow. It's pretty funny. So, we're going to get into cows. We might even start that this video. Wow, are you rich or something now? I will be. Not really that when much. When I sell this and I sell 100,000 liters of canola? Well, that's true. I'll have some money. You need a semi-trailer. I'm not there yet, John. Oh, I forgot. We're working You're our steps, your, remember? Using your stupid rules, I forgot. It's like 12 steps, one step at a time, John. Oh. That's one day at a time, but whatever. You should turn. I know, I was adjusting my microphone. You should turn. Anyway, so we're going to sell this stuff. Yeah, you do my dump trick. You pull up. You have to, it's easier. Damn right. So you'll see. You got that money coming in. i quite a bit off this, off this load of barley. Because it's a two times great demand. That's awesome. You know? 50 grand. I mean, I've made... Six, almost 60 grand a load. Off of one trailer, right. Holy crap. So we're going to estimate. Now, I, granted, I do have a $200,000 loan. 
Yeah, but that, then you, but I'm gonna let that ride for a little bit because I want to get into some things here. You repay that later. Right. You, okay. So look at that. That's a uh, hundred and twenty thousand dollars, basically. I mean, I don't. I don't think I've repaid that on my map, have I? Okay. So let's get this going here. Well, that's not the right one. Let's go. Yeah. So like I say, this canal's only a couple hours out from being ready. Yeah, yeah. And it's starting to clear up too, which is nice. Yeah. And the sun's out. The so hopefully, the sun will come out. Yes. Right now. Hopefully, by the time we get down here, the canal will be ready to go. Now. I'm not going to replant this field right away. What? Because I don't have the equipment I need, frankly. You don't have a planter? <laughs> I'm going to move it to sugar beets, remember? Oh, that's right. I don't have a cultivator or the you know, right. a sugar beet har uh, har uh, planter. Or harvester. Hey, you know what, John? Yeah. Shortcut. No, why Whee! are you doing... What? Your canola is not ready. Wee! Why are you... Oh, God. Wee! You should stop yelling into the microphone. Okay, I'm done. It's not good for it. Anyway... So the canola will be down here a little bit. Yeah. So we're going to go shopping real quick. Shopping? I like going shopping. I hate shopping, unless it's for Christmas lights or tools. These are kind of like tools. Or tractors, I mean, I, I guess. I'm actually going up. See, it's turning right now. Yay. Okay. That's only a slight problem. Why? Okay, because it's done now. So? Okay, so here's what we're going to do. Not do that. Oh. Uh -huh. We're going to do this. We're going to get him going. Yes. We're going to take this guy and just drop this planter back here for now. Uh-huh. Next to my furt spreader I bought. And that's the bigger furt spreader, too. Nice. And we're going to go shopping. So you can cover the field in, like, a round. Yeah. I'm going to buy another tractor. I'm, I'm going to be honest. I'm going to skip all these other small ones down here. What? I just I don't want to do them anymore. What? So, so much for your rule. We're starting with the regular pack now. Oh. Except not the Kramer. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you're getting this. So we're going to buy this same or samey, whatever You're it is. You're going to downgrade to that thing? This Argon 3. Wow. We're going to buy one of these. I don't have a ton of money, John. Okay. Right. And then we're going to buy Cultivator. We're up to this Lemkin because I've used the little one a bunch. Yeah. It's good. Actually, a really good Cultivator. Yeah, it will work. So we're going to buy the Lemkin. The one you start the game with. Right. And then we're going to buy... Sugar beet planter? Well, here's the thing. You buy the classic one. I think I'm going to. Because it's a lot cheaper than... Because uh, the only other option one. is this one, which is the, the six meter already. Yeah. And I don't really want to spend that... Well, I guess I could. It's only I have 60 the money. Grand. I'd buy it. I mean, the only other the only other sugar beet planter on this game is this little one here. Buy the big one. And I've used it a ton. We all know it. Big we all love one. it. Big so one. So I guess we'll buy that. Yay. Is that all I need for right now? I, I need. So. Well, I need, I need to sell some more stuff so I can buy the rest of the equipment. Because I need the, the topper thing here. Right? Uh, you're in potatoes, Holmes. Oh, well, whatever. So beets. There you go. I need the topper thingy here. Yeah. And then I need this, this uh, six row. $100,000 harvester. Right, which is fine. I have canola. It'll be okay. Just dance. So we're going to reset some things here because Sven Senior is really nice. Oh, man. Nice it's guy. It's still Sven Senior, yes. Oh, even though you changed. Right. Okay. What is up here still? That thing is. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Wow. Oh, hey, magic. Jump, jump. Everybody jump, jump. So, I believe this is canola. I forget, frankly. It looks like canola. I'm pretty sure it's canola. So, we're going to empty them out real quick. Yeah. So, we're going to put the cultivator on the schluter, the other schluter. Okay. Or, no, I guess we're not. Oh, shoot. The mm. little red one will cultivate. If you put a weight on the front. Does that thing take a weight? Yeah, it has a front three point. Okay. Pretty I'm, sure. I don't know if I've ever used that little tractor before. I don't think I ever have. So... You know. I always sell it. Or no, it doesn't spawn it doesn't, you with it. Yeah, you don't spawn with it. On PC version, you spawn with it, but right. on here, you don't. I've used it on the demo for Farm Sim 11. 12. 13. This this game is Farm Sim 13. I know, but I thought we had... Didn't we have the demo of 11 at one point? No, we had the full version of 11. That tractor's not on it. Oh, that's right. Okay, then it's the demo. Whatever. Yeah. Okay, so let's go get... With our non-gaming computers that we had. You need a front weight. Okay, so we need to now just put the planner on the back, on now, the front. What I want to do is take this guy over. I didn't unhook yet, which is actually good. I have a method to this madness. Uh, are you sure I'm I swear. about that? I don't think I've ever used this uh, planner either. It's actually a pretty good little planner. Because it, it's a no-till cultivating. Right. Oh, oh that's a post. What's in the corner of your shed back there? You'll see. Oh. Don't worry about it. What oh, did you just run I over? I dropped my front right on accident. Oh, I forgot this tractor has front weights. Oh, okay, God. so what's over in this corner... Is a classic fertilizer spreader. Oh, that's oh, laying over what? apparently. I was using it earlier. Shh. What did you do? I don't know. Can I get it? Oh, back up. I had it. Right. Come on, friend. Somewhere here. Okay, ram it again. 
Friend. Ram it. There it is. Wow, magic. I had this earlier, and I decided to keep it, obviously. Yeah. So, it's going to work out perfectly with the six-meter planter. Well, yeah, definitely. So, let's go get the front weight now. Oh, how convenient. You don't need to buy a front weight. Right? Wow, it's like Actually, you, it's kind of an accident. It's like you planned this, I even really though didn't. you didn't. Not at all. You should put the planter away. Yeah, you're not going to get that at all. Where'd it go? It's, you know, there. Oh, it's angled. You need to pick the planter up and move it. Yeah, I've noticed. I don't know if this thing's going to be able to pick this bad boy it'll, up. It'll pick it up just barely. Okay. I think. Urgh. Or completely fine like a boss. Oh, yeah, it's fine. That tractor must be a little overweighted like the uh, Ursas are. Uh, it's something, apparently. Yeah. Okay, so let's go get cultivating. This reminds me of our brother's tractor that he used to have. It really kind of does. He had a little um, uh, Kubota. Right. Kind of reminds me of it. One thing different is it had a front loader on it. Yeah. This thing doesn't. Yeah. Okay, so let's get cultivating. This thing just handles it nicely. Wow. Yeah, it was a nice little tractor. Yeah. I thought it'd be a little light, but... Nah, this, it, it's just, working. Just watch the turns. Right? Yeah. Oops. Yeah, it likes to... It's a little top-heavy, almost. It's really sensitive on the turns. I like this. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to get him going. Yeah. And we're going to go empty out the combine again. Senior combine. Nah. He's Frau Combine. Wait, that's, that's woman. Wow. Yeah. You know. We'll let these two pass. It'll make it easier. Yeah. Okay. So good, here we go. Good thing you're cutting all that grass back. It's just a little bit around the edges for weed, weed control. I, you, you don't need it anyway. Nope. It's not like you're going to use the grass here for the cows. No, that's the problem with this map compared to America. Yeah. Is it's so much more spread out and everything. And there's it's harder to get places. It's not... I mean... America's just open. Right. This map has, like, hills and crap and stuff. And so, I mean, I'm going to end up with two very distinct sets of equipment. Yeah, and then you run you into know. the chance, or the the very real problem of slottage. Yeah, totally. You run out of slots in this game way too easy. Right. So, that's that. Let's go get Mr. And Schluter. And that's where you have to be kind of careful with what you buy. Like, you, do you really need a case magnum? Because it's a lot of slots. Right. Yeah. Do you really need a quad track? No. Because it's a uh, lot of slots. Yeah, they're nice, though. They're awesome for cultivating. If you're doing a lot of corn, they're sure nice. Or sugar beets are sure nice. Yeah. Okay, so. Yeah, but you can pull the same cultivator with a nurse's. Yeah, it just looks stupid. You could probably pull it with the schluter with the barrel weight on the front. Uh, Maybe not the small. No, I don't. Well, it'll pull it, but it doesn't turn. The small one won't? It'll it'll pull it. It's just not pretty. Even with the barrel weight? Yeah, it'll do it. But Surprised. It's not my favorite thing to do. Because I know the big one won't do it. Okay. Because you can't put a weight on it. Right. Actually, no, the big one will pull it. Pull it? It likes to do wheelies, though. Oh, yeah. But it'll, in a, if you hire it out, it works fine. Huh. So we're going to make sure we plant sugar beets and not corn. Yeah. Because that would be a problem. Don't be the Mike the wrong seed guy. Actually, it wouldn't be that bad because it's just go buy a head for the combine. True. So No, not that combine. Uh, let's try this combine I mean, only has a... You could put it on there, but it, it's not right. correct. So this planter is the workhorse of... Sugar beets and a lot corn. of op operations. If you're doing a lot of silage, yep, this thing is worth its weight in gold. Pretty much, yeah. This thing doesn't have a corn head, huh? Not that come on. I guess it doesn't. I mean, you could put it on there. You have to put the big boy on there. Yeah, which, which would, would look, actually be pretty cool. Look very stupid. It'd just be hard to empty because your pipe's not long enough. Pretty much, yeah. Oh so, uh, yeah. How are we doing over here? Well, we don't need to empty him out very, very often, do we? No, not what's going to... So, like I said, we're going to focus on two things right now. Beets and cows. Yeah. I'm not doing sheep because of the sheep-wool sheep situation. Terrible. The bale situation. They're terrible. And I've come to the conclusion I've missed a spot right there. See it on the left? Yeah. Because I've cultivated it and stuff like nine times and it doesn't so it go So it needs to be plowed? It must need to be plowed right there. That's Which is basically, funny. if you know, if you look, it's right in line with that road. Yeah. So I guess I just missed a spot. It's kind of funny. Yeah. Because I've been over it a few times and it just stays there. It happens. So I'm not really worried about it. Yeah. So. It's like a liter, if that. Yeah. I mean, it's annoying because it's stupid and looks annoying. But I don't really feel like going to get in a plow to fix it. Yeah, because you don't own a plow right now, do you? I do not own a plow. Are you going to get back to the plow game or no? Well, now that I have uh, more more uh, modern equipment. And more tractors that are, you know. Well, I just meant, you know, like more modern planners and stuff. Yeah. Probably right, not right now. Right. But eventually I probably will. Because I do like plowing. Yeah. I mean, I went hardcore plowing back on America last season. Yeah. So I do like it, but, you know, 
I liked my end game where I plowed all the fields. Yeah, that was awesome. It took for effing ever, though. I'm sure it did. I can't imagine how long that took. Because I know just plowing a couple fields how slow that was. And I did all the end rows, so. too. Oh, and the other thing I'm going to do? By hand. The rule before was use something for three harvests or three uses. Yeah. Nah. No? Nah. Wow. Yeah. You're just completely blowing up your game. I know, but it's going to be better. Oh. I'm thinking one or two. All and, right. And it kind of depends on the equipment. Like this be uh, potato harvester or beet harvester I'm going to have. Yeah. Probably going to be a few harvests to make some money off of it. Yeah, because the big ones are very expensive. Yeah, big one's half mil, isn't it? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, yeah. 479 So, and this isn't a huge field. No. And so this isn't actually that bad to do. And it does three rows, basically. Three it or four. It does six rows. Wow. I didn't I, realize it was that big. I would argue that. How many does the big one do? Doesn't say. Uh, it doesn't say. It's no, it's no wider than the big one. Right. I would argue that six I rows. I don't think it does six rows either. It's maybe three. Right. Because I used this on a test map a while back. Yeah. I didn't think it was that big. No. I do know it fills up in a hurry. Yeah. you got to have a tipper stand, stand by all the time. Well, that's the problem, though, because you have to drive this thing. Yeah, you need multiplayer. And so you drive and stop and drive and stop and drive and stop. It's harvest take a while. Yay, I'm looking forward to it. So, uh, but that's what we're going to do. So we're going to, uh, let's see, we'll get the beets planted this week, this episode. Next episode, you mean? Uh, well, we'll start planting. Yeah, probably next episode. I'll you're say right. we're almost done, aren't we? Uh, yeah, we are. All right. We just need to get that cultivator rolling. We need a bigger tractor for the cultivator. Yeah, you do. He's going a little slow, but. You can make this your hauling tractor. It's too slow. Nah. Yeah. For just going out of the field? Oh, oh I for... mean that. I thought you meant hauling the, like, storage. No, for just emptying? Yeah, you're right. It'd probably work pretty good for that. It would work just fine. We may have to switch them. Yeah. You know what? You're going to switch Stop. it. Stop. In the middle of a pass while. Yep. Let it go. Drop it. <laughs> like it's hot. Drop it like it's hot. Drop yes. it like it's too heavy for you. Oh. Tippy tippy. That's why yeah. we have a roll bar, John. You might actually use it. It's scary when you use a roll bar. Come on, dude. I've never yeah. used one. Me either, but it doesn't look like I've thought one. about it a few times, though. Hmm. So, yeah. we'll get this field cultivated and planted and, you know, all that good jazz. Yay, jazz hands. Yep. Hopefully, Mr. Schluter will do better here. I'm sure he will. The other thing is we just need a bigger cultivator. Well, yeah. You need that six meter, I guess, even though it kind of sucks. The toe behind one? Yeah. You need a six meter uh, three-point hitch. Yeah. That would be awesome. Because really, from here up, they all suck until you get to the biggest one. Pretty much, yeah. Which is only like fast. two more. He goes, yeah, he goes like three miles an hour faster. Yeah. Yeah, because this one, this one's okay. This one, I've never used this. It's one. the same thing. But it's literally the same width. It's a dollar more expensive a day. Great. Yeah. Whatever. So there's that, and then this one is the one that we don't like. Yeah. It misses so much. It does. It's pretty bad. This one's not much better, frankly. Or actually, go back. It's only five point five meters. I yeah. thought it was six. That this one's, one's six. six. But they both miss a lot. Yeah. You got to go. This Vogel and Newt one is the way to 7. go. Seven point eight. It's the way to go, but it's heavy. Need nurses. So, well, that'll help out. He'll get going a lot faster. Here in Nurses Valley German Farm. I need this guy now. Right? Yes. Right. For sure. <laughs> He's going to be a little undersized for these tippers. But just out of the field and you're doing canola, you're not even going to fill one tipper. No, not at all. So, I mean, it's fine. And I have two hooked up, which is great. Yeah. So, we'll go sell all our canola after this, which is going to be a, quite a few. It'll be like three trips. Yeah. Um, Where are you going? I don't really know. It's like to the right more. Yeah. No, it's to the left. It's to the right. Oh, it's on an angle. Whoops. Yeah. It's okay. We'll get it. Yeah. There you go. Okay. Yeah, yeah, you're only at 17% of your little train here. Can so he haul this? You can't see him, but he can haul it. Look, it's oh, a tractorless uh, wagon. Ghost wagons. It's the, new, it's the new rage all these days with the kids, John. These kids. It's pretty dope, right? It's ill. Anyway. Um... Oh, he's actually ready to be empty, too. Oh, nice. wow. Well, he only holds, like, 4,500 liters. He's only going to do one more round, and he'll be done. Yeah, he'll be done. This goes that pretty was, quick. That was pretty fast, yeah. Yeah. His problem is when he gets to 80%, he fills up really quickly. Yeah. Well, it's canola, though. So. Well, that's true. I've been doing a lot of barley here lately. Yeah. So. But he'll basically come down. He'll end up back on the good side of the field. Yeah. Down here by the farm. Yep. And the last pass is just a sliver. It's pretty dope. So it's it's not bad. You're sick. It's ill. Ill. Tubular? No, not tubular. Just ill. Kids don't say that? Nope. No. Nope. Not at all. Okay. So that's what we're going to do. It's going to be great. So we'll yeah. pick this up next time. We're going to keep cultivating and we'll seed it next time. Yay. And we're going to sell our canola. 
Yeah. And get ready for the harvest here and for cows. Man, you just got a lot of stuff going on. Hopefully we can do all that next episode. If not, it'll bleed into next week. There you go. Until then, we're Mike and John from PumaPlow.com. See ya. Toodles.